Allegheny County may be increasing its political clout over the slightly larger Philadelphia County. As political editor John Delano reports, that's one conclusion some are drawing from the November 8th general election. There's always been a political rivalry between Pittsburgh and Philadelphia. Right now, only one of the seven elected statewide officials is from this region. That grows to two in January and maybe more in the future. Allegheny County has 133,000 fewer voters than Philadelphia, yet Allegheny County had 67,000 people vote in this 2022 election, more than Philadelphia did. Did you catch that? Even though Allegheny County has far fewer registered voters, in this election, its turnout exceeded Philadelphia by 67,000 votes. And that really is going to translate into greater political influence. People around the state are paying attention to that sort of thing. Why the shortfall in Philly? African Americans and Latinos make up 60% of the population. And Philadelphia based political strategist J.J. Balaban, a Democrat, says these voters did not turn out, which gave Allegheny County more clout. That the percentage of Black and Latino voters in Philadelphia is significantly higher than it is in Allegheny County. So what you're really seeing to some extent um, is uh, a failure to really meet these Black and Latino voters and communicate with them effectively and convince them to that it's worth their interest to turn out and vote. While turnout did fall in Black wards of Pittsburgh, local political analyst Kahari Mosley says that could reflect Blacks moving out of the city. I don't know if there was necessarily less uh, Black voters participated or the pool of Black voters in traditional Black communities in Allegheny County lost population and they moved into more traditionally white communities. Republican political strategist Ben Wren from Greensburg also credits hotly contested local races with driving up overall turnout here. Allegheny County had a strong turnout, and I think a lot of that has to go with the number of competitive races that were in Allegheny County. You had two congressional races that were uh, firing on all cylinders. You had a state Senate seat in the North Hills. You had several uh, different uh, state house races that were very competitive. Whatever the cause and effect, it's boosted Allegheny County's political clout, at least in the short term. But there's more to this story on the overall region. I'll have that new at six. John Delano, KDKA News.